on. So I wanted to give you a firsthand tour of what it's all like right here. So this right here is our championship car from 2015, the green M&M's crispy car, obviously. And then behind that is one of my most favorite walls and trophy cases that we've got with the championship trophy being in there. But what's special about this trophy case is it's got a trophy in it from every single racetrack that we've been to. I've wanted every single one of them, so I'm proud to say that I got a trophy from every single one of them right here at, uh, at Kyle Busch Motorsports in my collection. So um, with that, I'll kind of turn around right here. We've got my first Bristol sweep set. We got the double mint car, the Z-Line car, and of course the, uh, the NASCAR.com truck over there from the first time we did the Bristol sweep. But what's most cool, I think, is being able to do it the second time around. So I've got the second Bristol sweep set, thanks to Joe Gibbs Racing for the Xfinity car and the Cup car, and uh, my guys for letting me steal out of the rotation of our trucks, my own truck. So I had to pay for that, by the way. But no, it's uh, it's awesome to have all of this stuff right here at Kyle Busch Motorsports. And as I kind of walk you back and go this way a little bit, we've got some other cool trucks here, um, some show trucks and stuff. But then I've got what looks really cool is our super late models. So this super late model here is what I won the Snowball Derby with just a couple years ago. And then it kind of goes back in time as well with running in the late model division out in Las Vegas. This was the first car that I had growing up as a late model. And when I turned 16, I was able to race this one. And um, this is my modified that I had when I was 15. My dad and I, we bought this and then built it up and did everything that we could do to it to, to make it into a race winning machine as well too, back at our shop in Las Vegas, Nevada. And um, look, hey, I just made 500 starts this weekend. And what a crazy time and experience it's been, but I've got my first cup win car right here from Hendrick Motorsports and the uh, Tony the Tiger Kellogg's car. So really cool and special to have this one here. And uh, if we turn this way, you'll see that this whole wall is trophy cases as well too. And come, come to this one right here. So this trophy case here is basically like the Bristol case. I mean, there are Bristol trophies from 2007, 2006, 8, 9, 10, 11, 17, 18, 11, 13. And look, we've got so many of them, it's bleeding over. It's going into the second, the second case over here with Bristol trophies from 13, 15, 17, and um, a bunch of other trophies from some of these other racetracks. Daytona winning a Can-Am duel. California Speedway, this is one of the most cool ones, I think, because you kind of get the chrome woody on there. Obviously winning there in the Interstate Batteries car, we got the real die cast from the race that, uh, that we won out there in, in California. So lots of cool stuff here. Um, continue on down, we've got um, a mini family, I guess, of, uh, of monster trophies here as well, going from Texas, winning in Texas a few times. Uh, we got some Richmond trophies, New Hampshire. And uh, this is a cool one here, Watkins Glen, checking out the Zippo 200, finally being able to, to win there in the Xfinity series just a few years ago, and being able to knock another one of our boxes and check a box of being able to win at all the racetracks in the Xfinity series as well too. Hopefully that you enjoyed your experience of me kind of giving you a first-hand one-on-one tour of what it's all like here at Kyle Busch Motorsports and all of the history and things that I've got. 